Eleven Lab's new text-to-speech model. Drop whatever you're doing. Get rid of ChatGPT for a moment. This thing is blowing my mind. Beta.11labs.io. You'll be able to play with it directly there without even logging in. You can type your text into that text box and begin playing with text-to-speech or text-to-voice. It's incredible. Let's jump through it. There's not a lot of tech details here, but here's the interface. There are a bunch of generic voices here that are available. And all you need to do is type in your text and away it goes. I've been playing around with the stability and clarity and similarity flags. You can actually uh, up the clarity and similarity to get better results for your own voice. But I'm just gonna type some text in here and then we'll have a listen to what Eleven Labs does to it. This is better than Synantic or Synthesia to me, but you be the judge. Artificial intelligence is shifting the earth. GPT-4 is due out in 2023. Are you ready? You should be. That's really incredible to me. Do you remember James Weaver, the quantum developer advocate at IBM? He helped out with our Wolfram Alpha Plus Chat GPT video, which I think is towards a half million views now. I'm gonna take an extract of James talking. It's from this particular video. With Python, uh, the folks at Langchain, which is an open source project. I took a three minute extract from this recording and I plopped it into an audio editor. This is Audacity on Mac OS. And I didn't do anything with it, except made sure that I had a file that was gonna be under 10 megabytes and it should be longer than one minute. You can provide more than one sample. Exported that as a mono MP3 at only about 280 instead of 320. Then I can add voice here in 11 labs, agreeing that I'll take full responsibility for copyright infringement when cloning voices. I then upload that sample. Let's grab a little bit of text here from James' book on Kiskit. Here's what it sounds like. The quantum computing market is predicted to grow by nearly $1.3 billion over the next five years. Why? Given their quantum mechanical nature, quantum computers are expected to solve difficult problems in chemistry, optimization, finance, and machine learning that classical computers find impossible to unravel. Come on, that's outrageous. Here's an even better one. Remember Becky Robbins, who played around with Dolly 2 and Mid Journey with us? Learning and think of ideas, even like Alan, what you just said about, about prompts, like someone being like really good at prompts. I've never had to think about that before. Even describing my art was a little hard for me tonight to come up with another idea for that. She's amazing. Becky's really famous for her artwork. These canvases take one year each to draw by hand, paint by hand. They now go for over a million dollars each for the originals. Let's have a look through some of these. This one's called Pale Blue Dot. It was inspired, of course, by Carl Sagan's title, but it has so many different images inside it each with a little story. I'm just gonna grab a bit of text here from Becky Robbins' page, and I'm going to again import a little extract from her and play this back. When the Voyager 1 spacecraft was due to be slingshot into deep space after its mission and loaded with the golden record, Carl Sagan pleaded with NASA to turn the craft around one last time to take a photo of Earth from 3.7 billion miles away. The photo is grainy, and only by the arrow pointing to the tiniest dot can you see it in this barely visible shaft of light from the distant sun. That is something else. I hope you guys have your mind blown as much as I do. All right, let's try and do myself. This is my end of year AI report for 2022. It's a long report, but I thought if we're gonna grab some text, let's grab something that I've written before but haven't taken the time uh, to record verbatim. I think this is going to be one of the use cases for Eleven Labs and for text-to-speech in general, that you can just click a button and have your article read out by you. <laughs> I'm going to grab the closing of my report here, and this is what it sounds like. To align with the record-setting pace of AI releases, it is vital that leadership teams and overarching bodies keep up, and it is only possible to do so by taking a different path. The promise of artificial intelligence and its benefits is life-changing for everyone. 
As more and more people begin sitting up to take notice of today's AI performance, spectacular new models are already in the works and ready for release in 2023. From the dawn of real artificial general intelligence, AGI, to new ways of seeing the world through the eyes of AI, the sky is infinite. Well, they did warn me that they're only good at American accents at the moment, US accents, and they kind of destroy my Australian accent completely. I don't know if you can even recognize me there, but anyway. Here's 11 Labs Frequently Asked Questions. Their maximum number of characters you can generate is 2,500. Uh, you do own a commercial license if you're paying a monthly subscription. I'm just using the free tier here where you have to include the attribution. There's again, not a lot of technical documentation on this. I'd really like to know which particular model they're using, whether they're using Transformer or not. I believe they would be. Uh, and I also noticed here under the, are there any restrictions part of the FAQ that actually all audio generated by their model will be watermarked so that it can be instantly traced back to us. So if you're thinking of cloning someone else and then releasing it, be very careful. Audio watermarks are still quite resilient. That was 11 Labs. Play around with it yourself for free, including generating your own voice. All of that's free for a particular number of characters. I'm having a blast playing around with this. Where do the experts come to learn more about bleeding edge artificial intelligence? They come to read the memo. We've just added paid subscribers from PwC, Cirque du Soleil, Apple. I'll see you there. Did you see the memo about this? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I have the memo right here. Love artificial intelligence? Excited by the explosive progress of integrated AI? I am. Join my private mailing list, The Memo. Did you get that memo? Yeah, I got the memo. Get priority access to my articles, videos, and behind the scenes tips as soon as they're released with a monthly or annual subscription. Yeah. Didn't you get that memo? Lifearchitect.ai slash memo. I have the memo.